Carbonyl sulfide is the chemical compound with the linear formula OCS. Normally written as CUS is a chemical formula that does not imply its structure, it is a colorless flammable gas with an unpleasant odor. It is a linear molecule consisting of a carbonyl group double bonded to a sulfur atom. Carbonyl sulfide can be considered to be intermediate between carbon dioxide and carbon disulfide, both of which are valence isoelectronic with it. Carbonyl sulfide decomposes in the presence of humidity and bases to carbon dioxide and hydrogen sulfide. This compound is found to catalyze the formation of peptides from amino acids. This finding is an extension of the Miller-Urey experiment and it is suggested that carbonyl sulfide played a significant role in the origin of life. Occurrence Carbonyl sulfide is the most abundant sulfur compound naturally present in the atmosphere, at 0.5 plus or minus 0.05 ppb, because it is emitted from oceans, volcanoes and deep sea vents. As such, it is a significant compound in the global sulfur cycle. Measurements on the Antarctica ice cores and from air trapped in snow above glaciers fern air, have provided a detailed picture of OCS concentrations from 1640 to the present day and allow an understanding of the relative importance of anthropogenic and non-anthropogenic sources of this gas to the atmosphere. Some carbonyl sulfide that is transported into the stratospheric sulfate layer is oxidized to sulfuric acid. Sulfuric acid forms particulate which affects energy balance due to light scattering. The long atmospheric lifetime of CUS makes it the major source of stratospheric sulfate, though sulfur dioxide from volcanic activity can be significant too. Carbonyl sulfide is also removed from the atmosphere by terrestrial vegetation by enzymes associated with the uptake of carbon dioxide during photosynthesis, and by hydrolysis in ocean waters. Loss processes, such as these, limit the persistence or lifetime of a molecule of CUS in the atmosphere to a few years. The largest man-made sources of carbonyl sulfide release include its primary use as a chemical intermediate and as a byproduct of carbon disulfide production, however, it is also released from automobiles and their tire wear, coal-fired power plants, coking ovens, biomass combustion, fish processing, combustion of refuse and plastics, petroleum manufacture, and manufacture of synthetic fibers, starch, and rubber. The average total worldwide release of carbonyl sulfide to the atmosphere has been estimated at about 3 million tons per year, of which less than one-third was related to human activity. It is also a significant sulfur-containing impurity in synthesis gas. Carbonyl sulfide is present in foodstuffs, such as cheese and prepared vegetables of the cabbage family. Traces of cuz are naturally present in grains and seeds in the range of 0.05 to 0.1 mg kg-1. Carbonyl sulfide has been observed in the interstellar medium. See also list of molecules in interstellar space in comet 67P and in the atmosphere of Venus where because of the difficulty of producing cuz inorganically, it is considered a possible indicator of life. Applications Carbonyl sulfide is used as an intermediate in the production of thiocarbamate herbicides. Carbonyl sulfide is a potential alternative fumigant to methyl bromide and phosphine. In some cases, however, residues on the grain result in flavors that are unacceptable to consumers, e.g. barley used for brewing. Carbonyl sulfide is readily converted to the gaseous signaling molecule hydrogen sulfide by carbonic anhydrase enzymes in plants and mammals. Because of this chemistry, the release of carbonyl sulfide from small organic molecules has been identified as a strategy for delivering hydrogen sulfide in different biological contexts. Synthesis carbonyl sulfide was first described in 1841, but was apparently mischaracterized as a mixture of carbon dioxide and hydrogen sulfide. Carl Bonn then first characterized the substance in 1867. It forms when carbon monoxide reacts with molten sulfur. This reaction reverses above 1200 K, 930 degrees Celsius, 1700 degrees Fahrenheit. A laboratory synthesis entails the reaction potassium thiocyanate and sulfuric acid. The resulting gas contains significant amounts of byproducts and requires purification. KSCN plus 2H2SO4 plus H2O KHSO4 plus NH4HSO4 plus cos hydrolysis of isothiocyanates in hydrochloric acid solution also affords cuz. 
Toxicity As of 1994, limited information existed on the acute toxicity of carbonyl sulfide in humans and in animals. High concentrations, greater than 1,000 ppm, can cause sudden collapse, convulsions, and death from respiratory paralysis. Occasional fatalities have been reported, practically without local irritation or olfactory warning. In tests with rats, 50% animals died when exposed to 1400 ppm of cuz for 90 minutes, or at 3000 ppm for 9 minutes. Limited studies with laboratory animals also suggest that continued inhalation of low concentrations approximately 50 ppm for up to 12 weeks does not affect the lungs or the heart. References Further reading Beck, M. T., Kaufman, G. B., 1985. Cousin C3S2, The Discovery and Chemistry of Two Important Inorganic Sulfur Compounds. Polyhedron, 4, 5, 775 to 781. Doi 10.1016 S0277538700-87025-4. Savoranos PDN, Bruno TJ, 2002. Carbonyl sulfide: A review of its chemistry and properties. Industrial and Engineering Chemistry Research. 41, 22, 5321, 5336. Doi 10.1021/IE020365N. External links Carbonyl sulfide and origins of life Carbonyl sulfide as a potential fumigant Carbonyl sulfide in the atmosphere